Welcome to this week's episode of Patriot News. We are going to be talking to many students from this campus and the Salt Lake campus about what they are grateful for. So let's go talk to them. Where's my brothers? Wait, wait, but why? Why? What happened? Okay. Yeah. My name is Sam Durham. I am 16 years old, and I'm grateful for bagels and cream cheese. I'm Carly Bonk, and I'm 16, and that's crazy because I'm thankful for my twin brother Carson. My name is Max Buer. Uh, I'm a junior. This is Simon. Say hi, Simon. Hello. Uh, this is Abby. She's 17. And this is Annalie, and she's 16. We're sisters, you couldn't tell. I'm Gideon Bogus. I'm 17 years old, and I'm grateful for glasses. I'm Portia, I'm 15, and I'm thankful for popsicles. What up, what up? Joe Holmes here, I'm a junior at American Heritage High School. Cut! <laughs> my younger brother, Isaac Holmes, eighth grade, better brother. Walmart, I'm grateful for Walmart, really grateful for Walmart. Walmart and, um... Jellyfish, they really inspired me. And I am very grateful for my twin sister Carly. That's crazy because I was about to say the same thing. No way. Uh, <laughs> I'm grateful for my family, all my brothers that were super close. I'm grateful for all the homies out there. I'm grateful for my parents and like family for everything they've done for me. My name is River Durham. I'm 14 and uh, man I'm, I'm grateful for this wonderful school. It's great. The people here are wonderful. The teachers are great. Um, I'm grateful for the opportunity to go to the school with my sister. This is my sister Savannah, she's in ninth grade. And this is my twin sister Isabel. This is my brother Sam. This is my brother Will. A few things that I'm grateful for are my family, friends, the a living prophet, and the church. I'm grateful for my family and my friends that make my life so much more fun because without them, I would not be the person that I am today. I'm grateful for my opportunity to go to the school and be taught by the amazing teachers. I'm grateful for my family, especially my brother, as he's been helping me recover from surgery. So it's been really nice to be able to have him help me. I'm thankful for Walmart and gasoline. I'm thankful for pine cones. I'm thankful for trees. I'm grateful for the smell of popcorn. I'm grateful for Wednesday lunches um, because we get to have actually good food and I can go with my sister. I'm grateful for NFL football and I'm thankful for you guys bringing me here today to be on Patriot News. <laughs> was that good? <laughs> we would like to acknowledge the passing of President M. Russell Ballard. He became an apostle of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints on October 6th of 1985. As today's apostles are called to be special witnesses of Jesus Christ. Our thoughts are with his family and those who knew him and all of the members of the church. Okay, those interviews were awesome. Now, let's hear the current events with Cameron. Welcome back to current events. I'm Cameron from Current Events, and next week we have Thanksgiving break. Just a couple weeks ago, we had the Newsies musical. I heard it was awesome. And then, um, yeah, it's midterms when the break starts, so get your grades up so your parents don't see it. Woohoo! Tyson, Clemson, it's so cold! It's so cold! If only there was a way for us to stay warm and stay in uniform. Ugh. Don't you know, there is a warm coat that is uniform. Even computers love a man in uniform. Thank you to all the people we interviewed. They were really good interviews. And we are so grateful for this program that we're able to talk to all of you guys and bring out information and so you guys, you know, know what's happening. Anyways, remember to be friends, be scholars, and be patriots. And have a happy Thanksgiving. Oh! Do I look hot? The line is warm. Warm? Do I look warm? 